Okay, so I figured for today's video, we're gonna go ahead and watch the first trailer and then the last trailer for Final Fantasy VII Rebirth because at the time of this recording, this is dropping in the next couple of hours. And so in a way, just kind of like a, you know, like a celebration of like, hey, FF7 Rebirth is finally here and we're all about to lose the next 200 probably plus hours into this game because it seems to be ginormous from what the reviews are saying. To get the platinum, it takes like 150 to 200 plus hours. Ridiculous. So in honor and the celebration of FF7 Rebirth uh, for releasing, let's just go ahead and watch the very first trailer and then watch the last trailer. At least the official ones that are dubbed final trailer and then first look, going it by that way. So let's go ahead and go and check this one out first. It's been a while since I've seen the very first trailer, but obviously I just remember we just recently saw, right, that last trailer. Let's go ahead and do this. I cannot wait. I, I'm so, I can't believe we're hours away. The past is forever, but the future, even if it has been written, can be changed. But down just a little bit. Focus on the future, not the past. I still, I still, this is what I remember the most. Was the Sephiroth and Cloud scene, and for those that know with Zack, I was like, dude, oh my god, we're gonna get this freaking flashback moment. I saw you lying there. Oh my god, you don't even see any of like the UI and stuff like that. I forgot how early this was. That I died? That I'm some kind of imposter? You were here with me five years ago. Dude. Seeing Zach is uh, like, what happened to you? I remember first seeing this being I'm like, so they're gonna focus to on you. Zach to some degree, so right? I Obviously. Feel like I failed you. Like it was gonna be more than just like that tease at the end of uh, of remake and then intermission, to like to what degree, or whatever. Like the fact that Rebirth kept just showing more of Zach, it was just like, dude, he's gonna play a significant role probably in this new. I. I I guess you could say new trilogy in a way, I guess, right? I mean, even though it's it's going to still cover the same story for the most part, it is still deviating and, and changing in some ways for, for, again, for the most part. This was, I remember this was a big drop. Next winter, I think a lot of us were trying to think like, oh, this is probably going to be more so like, I don't know, it could be much further than what we might have anticipated or even delayed. But for the most part, they pretty much kept to just about the same time frame. I mean, February is still considered winter, keep that in mind. I think that was, what is, oh, okay, yeah, I do remember, and then showing Reunion, also this winter, and an Integrate, that's right, I think it was like a whole, like, Final Fantasy special presentation, I think, I don't remember, this was from a Square, if it was from a Square Enix Presents or not, I, I don't recall, but either way, I think I remember it was like one after another after another, it was like an, it was like an entire thing focused on the Final Fantasy VII 25th anniversary, that's literally probably what it was, I'm an idiot, I'm looking at it right in the face, <laughs> yeah, I think I remember, yeah, yeah. All right, this is cool. Now let's go ahead and watch the last one. Oh, I, I literally look at the time right now. It's like eight o'clock my time and it comes out at midnight for Eastern. So like, I'm just, it's hours away at this point. It's, it's crazy, man. I play the hell out of the demos. I mean, I, I, I did as much as I could from the demo. And so now it's just like, I'm ready, dude. I'm ready for this, for the game. Like I'm ready to just get the story and experience it. Learn what we're going to get, man. See what direction they're going to go. Cloud. Bring me the black materia. I can't. The beginning of the end. The celebration of the faithful. <laughs> A watershed moment for all mankind. Hey kids, sorry we're late. Dude, see this fight? <laughs> Tifa. Dude, like, I'm so excited to see the cutscenes and how they just do all of this. Like, I. Ah, oh, God, I can't freaking wait, dude. Dude, the rest of the synergy attacks too, man. I'm, I'm so, I'm so down. I'm, Cause you only get so many from the demo, so you're gonna obviously get the rest of them in the full game. Down Corneo back. Dude, the golden saucer. Oh, I cannot wait. Rorsch being back too. Ah. Oh. Very good. Fill your hollow heart with rage. No, bro. This is Rochelle Zachary, right, Aaron.
I literally, I literally have a heart attack when I see this because like, I obviously the biggest thing is like, is, is going to be like the whole thing with Zach and Eric, like what, what, like what the fuck is going to be the story here like what like what is it gonna be like Aerith is obviously she can't wake up marlene had mentioned a line where like i forget something about like she can't wake i don't know if it's i can't remember if it's in this trailer or the last one or whatever but it's like this story like line right here like i I, i'm so like i don't even have words bro but just to see zach be back with Aerith, like it'll get me emotional as hell man i'm back now Aerith. i'm back I can't, dude. I'm such a little punk. It's just so sad, dude. I can't. I'm so excited. The black this song, too. To our oblivion. Please. It alone can liberate us from this endless dream. Passing through. By the way, confirmed Cisne too. She's part of like a Gungaga, uh, like def like I don't want to say defense force, but like something of those lines. Like she's like a part of like a like a group uh, for Gungaga, I think, or something like that. It, it's just the, the fact that they're incorporating other the characters from previous games or from the side games into this main storyline. Ah, dude. You. Tifa! Johnny's back. Ooh. Hey guys. They're getting some sun too, huh? Yeah. Well, Red, how do we look? Huh? <clears throat> you should get yourself a ring. It's got to be hiding some ginormous materia. The song is actually really good too, man. Dude, I we're here. Like we we've made it. I mean, at this point, people who are watching this, it's probably the game has launched. So look at this as again, just like a yo, we made it. Like we're he, he freaking made it, Vincent. Oh my God, Vincent! You wouldn't believe what he can do. I can't, dude. It sucks. It's a shame that like Vincent's not gonna be playable, but I don't care. Like, bring obviously he him and Sid will be playable in the third game, which is totally fine. Wait, I, don't misunderstand. You'll need a way home. So when you're ready, I'll be here. An emissary from Wu Tai is here, sent by Viceroy Saru. With all this goddamn blood on my hands, how could I ever hold my daughter again? Those we hate, those we love, those we fear. Genova would become anyone to fool her prey. Don't do this! But I'm no fool. Sephiroth! Hey! Dude! Oh, I can't, dude. You. Here. Take it. The white material. This isn't about me, though. It's about saving the world and you. The reunion, when spite and sorrow are harvested. Like this, like where is Aerith here? This also, this this scene here gets me because I'm like, like. Feed the planet. No. No. I'm make sure I'm not going crazy, but like Aerith is not. She's like definitely not here. I'm just one more time. Yeah, like everybody is here, unless I'm going crazy, but Aerith. Sorrow or harvested. Uh yeah, yeah. And then this scene too, like we fear. Not, yeah, this okay, sorry, I meant the Zach scene, but yeah, this too. To fool her prey. Don't do this! But I'm no fool. Like Cloud just getting I don't know if it's the corruption from Sephiroth or what it is exactly, but like Attacking Tifa is crazy, but this though, it's like the reunion again of Zach and Sephiroth to talk about God knows what, bro. I mean, obviously it's gonna be about like what's going on, Aerith. Hello, you're going mad. Like, what is happening? Dude, I oh my god, I I I'm so excited. I again I am hours away. This video is going up literally before the game launches. But again, people are gonna be watching this probably after the fact. So I just want to say, if anything, like Rebirth is here. We made it, y'all. Like, happy Rebirth Day, if anything. Um, and if not, happy Rebirth Eve, I guess you could say, dude. We freaking made it. I, I, it's, still, it's still crazy that this has happened. But ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to end the video here. I just want to toss out like a little celebratory uh, FS7 Rebirth uh, video. Whether it's, again, you're watching this on the night before, right before leading up into the game's launch, or you watch this afterwards. We made it. It's here. Uh, yeah, give me your guys' thoughts. Who, who's playing Rebirth Day 1? Is anybody waiting to play Rebirth? I mean, it's kind of crazy if you are, but I understand it. 
Uh, but like, what are your predictions for story wise? I mean, what do you think? Uh, are you gonna go for the platinum? Let me know all that stuff down below in the comment section. I am Jared, aka Lethal One Up, and I will see you guys post rebirth. I mean, I'm gonna definitely still be dropping videos, but. I want to be covering this game as much as I can, hopefully on the channel and also on Twitch. So make sure you're following the Twitch channel, uh, twitch.tv slash lethal one up. If you're not already subscribed to the YouTube channel here. So just keep that in mind. All right. I'm going to end it now. Thank you guys for watching. I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.